Hey everyone, Tim with Collect Jurassic here with a very exciting news update for Mattel. Of course, the Jurassic World Hammond Collection, their adult-oriented collector line, has been popular since it first came out, and now we're having a exclusive release at San Diego Comic-Con of an awesome new set. Of course, Mattel's been doing the San Diego Comic-Con exclusives every year. Even when there was no Comic-Con, they were doing the exclusive at-home uh product releases and now we have this one that'll be at that show as well as mattelcreations.com and it is an awesome one so stay tuned for more details but let's go ahead and break this set down this is the outhouse chaos set depicting the iconic jurassic park scene of course with a uh, Gennaro running into the bathroom stall pursued by the t-rex where he is of course uh, eaten by the rex and one of the cooler graphic kills of the uh, jurassic film franchise right and this set is so cool you can see in this promo photo right here we have the t-rex we have a fully articulated uh, donald Gennaro figure for the first time as well as the fun little outpost that's part of the or outhouse that's part of the packaging too but first let's talk about that t-rex this is of course the very popular their Hammond Collection T-Rex with all that added articulation and paint detail. Um, of course, I'm sure you've seen the review on my channel, and if not, definitely check it out. But this figure that's coming out as part of the Outhouse Chaos set is actually a little bit different. It has an exclusive deco that's, uh, I think they call it rain-themed, so sort of um, inspired by the uh, Rex's coat of, uh, I guess, rain um, that it has in the film, right? So I'm guessing it'll be a little glossier, a little darker. Um, these pictures make it a little bit hard to hard to see exactly what's different about it but again I'm, I'm uh expecting it to just be sort of a darker more like storm lit coat and maybe a little bit of gloss for the rain uh, either way i mean exclusive coat or not this is just an awesome awesome figure uh the t-rex is full of articulation and the fact that they're including it in this exclusive set is a no-brainer because you know it's obviously a very popular toy and it's going to just add to getting Gennaro um in the first place and kind of complete the whole scene right the whole scene of course being the outhouse which is part of the actual package you can see in these promo photos uh, there's a little cardboard outhouse that it comes with even with a little thatch roof and then the you know the the iconic sign on the front uh, literally iconic with those um, uh, man and woman icons for the bathroom and this thing is just perfect um and as part of the set it actually comes in the box which we'll look at here in a little bit but um there's the you know the rex uh glowering at it you know getting ready to attack and it looks like this the the little outhouse itself kind of comes apart roof comes off you can see in this attack shot the t-rex is literally um breaking in and destroying it so i'm anxious to see um kind of how this all fits in with the toy itself because i know that um Gennaro actually is inside right and there's an electronic and light uh, a feature with that base, kind of like all the other Comic Con exclusives, um, since Nedry uh, had some sort of electronic and light activation. So I'm guessing this one has it um, at the actual bottom of the outhouse, which we can see in this next shot. Once you take off that um, the walls and everything, you have the <laughs> the toilet right um, with Gennaro inside, and that's probably the portion that has the lights and sounds. But come on, they're literally giving us a toy toilet. I mean, you cannot make this stuff up. This is just an excellent toy and these photos they did just do a great job selling this toy a toy that sells itself but i mean look at these awesome photos rex looking down Gennaro holding his hat um you know waiting for the end right with an actual plastic potty which i just i love that um but the hat itself on Gennaro actually does come off which is pretty cool i don't know why they didn't do that with um grant or hammond but i'm guessing it's because Gennaro's bald so his uh his hat fits a little more snug, but love this shot too um, with him kind of um, cowering in fear. And that's what's great about this being a Hammond Collection release is that there's a little bit more articulated options you can do with the wrists, you know, kind of holding his hands up and um, the knees bending a certain kind of way back on the toilet. All stuff you couldn't do with a regular Legacy Collection figure. So um, nice to have that added uh, option here. Of course, we got another shot of the T-Rex eating him on the toilet. I got to say, I love this toilet. I'm, I'm, I can't believe they included it. If you remember last year's uh, exclusive was um, Arnold, and it came with the power bank, like the power generator that was turning on. That was such a cool little plastic prop with stickers on it. So, um, I mean, them giving us a toilet just totally completes this set. I do think the outhouse itself is just cardboard, um, but it's probably going to be pretty heavy-duty stuff like their other cardboard elements of their exclusives. Um, and then, you know, with the Rex, you can complete this entire scene, including the uh, actual ingestion of the lawyer. Um, 
Again, just such a cool set altogether. I do wish it came with some fences in the background, and as, as I'm sure a lot of you watching out here would agree, we're sorely missing fences. But I mean, come on, Mattel's getting there. They're they're going down the list. They're hitting every single wish toy wish we had: articulated T-Rex, Brachiosaurus, uh, Explorer. Now we have Gennaro coming. So um, they've really hit almost everything, and this pack just looks awesome. Um, even the packaging just totally sells me on this thing. I love the huge Jurassic Park logo in the jungle and I love how they have the T-Rex kind of coming down on uh, Gennaro with his arms up on the toilet it's perfect um, I'm guessing the outhouse is somewhere in there sort of like and under the Rex in the back we just have to wait and see but man what a beautiful piece of packaging certainly one that I'm going to be keeping in the box um, if I can get two I'll be opening another one but certainly if I only get one it's staying in the box this is just a beautiful box but I do want to show their little animatic that Mattel did Yeah, they did that little animation that I thought was super cool with Stop Go, um, you know, animatics with the toy itself. Just recreating that scene perfectly, which was definitely a fun way to announce it, too, alongside these really cool diorama photos they took. So here's another view of that T-Rex. If you're interested, um, you can see, I mean, I think it has like a, a sheet of sort of gloss on it to make it look like it's in the rain. But um, that could also just be the lighting and effects they did to the toy. But rest assured, it will be an all new deco um, from the Hammond Collection T-Rex that just came out already. So, um, I mean, even seeing in this one, it really looks like it has a gloss coat on it. So I'm guessing that's the main difference, but it'll be cool to get two different Hammond Collection Rexes now and kind of gives me hope that we'll have a... Um, another one, all right, like a bull T-Rex later on or something. If they're already not afraid to repaint it for this set, um, I know a lot of folks out there would would love to have uh, the Rex from Sorna and, you know, um, the, maybe even like the JP3 Rex with this coat of paint. So we'll just have to wait and see um, what, how they repaint that. But I think the real star of this set for me is definitely the Donald Gennaro figure. I mean, they just nailed him. He's got the shorts. He's got the hat. Um, he's even got a briefcase. I mean, come on. He's, he's all ready to go. So definitely one of the the last figures we were missing in the three and three quarter size and now we're getting him so which is pretty fun um and i love the fact that uh they didn't make him um break in half i guess but i, I do love the fact that he comes with the rex so that he can at least get eaten and kind of complete the scene um and speaking of completing the scene i think that the inclusion of the outhouse was was obviously um essential for getting this set or for selling this set so uh, i was hoping for something a little more plastic a little more permanent but uh cardboard version at least gets the job done and it's, it's kind of in line with what they've been doing with the you know the the power generator room last year and even elements of Nedry's exclusive figure at comic-con um, you know weren't weren't all uh, plastic some of it was cardboard so uh, at least they put it some effort into it and it does look like a pretty nice little prop and all together again this set just looks incredible uh, I, the box art is just something that's you know just they truly killed it with the, the Jurassic Park logo on it and uh, all the jungle motif and all that. I'm anxious to open it up and see how the outhouse fits in, but at least we know it's going to display just incredibly in the box without even getting it out. Um, just such a cool toy um, and an awesome addition to the long line of awesome Comic-Con releases they've been doing. It seems like they're outdoing themselves every year more and more, so they really got to work hard <laughs> to top this one, I think, because I think we can all agree that this is easily you know one of the better ones if not the best that they've done so um, exciting to see Hammond Collection getting a little bit of love this year at Comic-Con and then of course we're really excited to see where Hammond Collection goes um, for the general release but if you're interested in where you can track this particular toy down uh, January or sorry July 22nd which is next Friday 9 p 9 a.m pacific uh, mattelcreations.com head over there you'll be able to hopefully pre-order it I'm sure it's going to be a hot one and go pretty fast also if you're attending comic-con on site you'll be able to grab it there as well so awesome stuff hope you enjoyed this news update again I'm Tim with Collect Jurassic thanks for watching and I'll see you next time